Noma was really important part of being a good journalist. Um, my husband and I have this war regularly at home. Um, when I say you're going to war sucks. Yeah. Uh, I'm tired of having a guess um, and trying to figure it out. Mm -hmm. So the reality is, I think that uh, things would be a lot worse if there was no one doing anything behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. I mean, you see a lot of false errors and, um, and things being revealed to us um, that, that indicate that there are people behind the scenes. I think if you listen to General Flynn, it's a mistake to think that we can sit back and do nothing and then they're just, you know, these behind the scenes people are gonna ride it and they're white horses and fix it all. Because the scale of what is happening, it means that there's not an ordinary solution to this, to me. I mean, what's Trump gonna do? Because by some miracle, they actually allow him to take office. Then what's he gonna do? Go to rest? Obama, Biden, Clapper, Brennan, Hillary, Susan Rice, I mean, you know, the list goes on and on and on. So, so the very same Justice Department that's putting people in jail, generally says that just jail is, is about to jail a 76-year-old grandmother who prayed inside the Capitol for eight minutes. These people are going to go and, and arrest those people? I mean, your, your deep state is not a conspiracy theory. You've got the Senior Executive Service, SES. That's your deep state. These are bureaucrats that operate uh, in the shadows, who have a, um, a higher salary level, they operate under different rules, it's very difficult to fire them and so on. I mean, I think 70% of the Justice Department are members of the SES, when, which is why when, when Bill Barr uh, fired the number two of the Justice Department, which Trump ordered him to, the guy refused to leave his job. And then designated his own successor. So one man can't do this alone, and if people don't rise up and, and, and demand uh, accountability, it's not going to happen. And um, and I just um, I think we really don't know the extent uh, to which people are working behind the scenes. I do believe that there are people working behind the scenes. I do believe there are good people who are doing things. I am not 100%. There's some things that you see happening, and I'm not 100% sure that that's really the Biden administration doing that because it doesn't it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. And you start to wonder if there are, you know, if there are two tracks, maybe two militaries in a sense that are operating. But the truth is it's unknowable for us. We're just we're not able to figure that out. So we can guess, we can try to figure it out, but we just don't know. Brandy.